top story for you is out of Macon County, as we've learned that several people were injured after an explosion at ADM in Decatur. This all happened at the East Plant Processing Complex just after 7 o'clock. And so this is all located on the north side of Decatur, right off of East Ferries Parkway, which is also close to Lake Decatur. We've had our reporter out there all morning long, WCI3's Bradley Swank, who joins us live there now at noon. Bradley, what is the latest for us? Well, Matthew, I just got done talking with the mayor of Decatur, and she says she's still processing and learning what happened. She told me that everything that happened last night was just kind of fast for her, and they are still working to learn more from ADM. They're still waiting. She says the city sends their hopes and prayers, or thoughts and prayers, to the victims as well. Now, as of what we know right now, the Decatur Fire Department has confirmed that they're it, from the eight people have been hurt from the explosion and it sent six of them to the hospital. The fire department got the call around seven last night and they still have a crew on scene or at least at last check they did to make sure they do not have any more hot spots from the fire. Now we are still working to learn more information. This is still a very developing story. We will keep you updated on air and online as we get that information. Reporting live indicator on Bradley Swank, WCI3, your local news leader. All righty, Bradley, thank you. And again, at home, you can stay tuned to WCIA.com for any updates. Now, we also know the governor has responded to this particular incident by saying on your screen, quote, our hearts are with the families of those affected by the explosion in Decatur last night, and my administration is in touch with those at ADM and have offered state support in any way we can. Well, Richland.